I-5 is finally back open, but some people had to spend the night in their cars. Action News Now reporter Anna Torreya spoke with one man who had been waiting since early in the morning. I'm here along Wonderland Boulevard just next to I-5 and behind me you can see those big rigs that are lined up here stretching all the way down in that direction. Now they've been here since last night. Getting stuck because of snow on I-5 isn't new for Hank Lawrence. It was easy coming up I-5 until we got to this and then uh, I took some side roads to get to here to avoid all the truck traffic that's backed up for what, back to Reading. Lawrence was driving up from Marysville and he made sure he was prepared, packing clothes, a sleeping bag, shoes and other tools. A shovel, I got a sandbag, I got 20 gallons of gas. Caltrans urges people not to travel under wet, icy conditions, but if you do, make sure you are prepared and to expect slowdowns and delays. Reporting in Shasta County, Anna Torreya, Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Lawrence says if the road didn't reopen today, he would have had to head back to Marysville to go hunting.